Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So you guys are gonna see this look in like three different videos, so just bear with me. First of all, I did do a tutorial on this look if you're interested. I know blues are kind of crazy and not everybody wants them. I do plan on to, uh, filming a um, uh, kind of like a soft glam next, so that is coming. But in the meantime, this is kind of what I decided to go with. I wanted to play with my hip dot palette that I got and uh, this was my first time playing with it and I was actually quite impressed. So blues can definitely be intimidating. I know I was looking at myself like where are you going with this look but <laughs> the colors are really pretty and I'm happy with the way it turned out. So with that being said we are here today to unbag our Ipsy Glam Bag Plus bag. <laughs> I am so excited. I've always been a fan of Ipsy. Only a few bags here and there I was kind of disappointed by, but for the most part, Ipsy does um, have really good bags. So I'm really, really excited. And uh, yeah, let's see what we got for the month of March. So right away, with their point system, I bought the Violet Voss Essentials 2 palette. So this was in the bag, but this isn't a part of this month's bag. So I actually used my points, and this is going to go in my next giveaway. So this is going to be for you guys. It is a colorful palette. Let me show you quickly what it looks like. I'm not going to do any swatches or anything like that. But I actually do enjoy the Violet Voss uh, formula. So there's some really, really pretty shades in here. You've got some neutral shades, uh, some pops of color, and I just think this is a overall nice palette. So hopefully you, one of you lucky winners will enjoy that when my next giveaway goes live. Alright, and one more thing before we get started with the bag itself. I did purchase a Huda Beauty Demi Matte. I absolutely love Huda Beauty lipsticks. I'm actually wearing Wifey today. This is the second formula that she came out with, uh, her Demi Matte, and this is in the shade Boy Collector. So um, this is a red shade. I've actually been loving reds lately, and I don't have a solid red from her. So I was really excited to see this in, uh, on the add-ons at a discount. And isn't that shade stunning? Oh my gosh, it is so stunning. I cannot wait to do a look with this. The theme of the bag is Stronger Together. I love that. That is such a good theme. Uh, so it says, like Sharon Dion, the red lipstick and cat eye, some things that are just better together. Celebrate the people and the products that make you look and feel your best. So, yes. All right, the first item we have is a set of brushes. The top three things that I love receiving in my bags are definitely eyeshadow palettes, number one, uh, brushes, and highlighters. So this is definitely right up my alley and they look really nice. So let's go ahead and open these up and see what they feel like. The fact that they're eye brushes too is another plus for me. I don't really tend to use face brushes a lot. I have enough, um, but eye brushes I seem like I can never get enough of. So. Um, these feel really, really light, but not in a cheap sense, so that's good. So it looks like we got a standout sweep brush. This is obviously a uh, contour crease brush. Uh, this is a little detailer smoky brush. So that's actually cool. So it's like a angled flat brush that would be really easy to get it underneath your, uh, on your lower lash line. So that's cool. This is your Come Through Contour Angled Brush. I really don't use angled brushes too much, so I might put this back in the bag and pass that along. And the uh, Miss Shady Lady. So um, they feel really, really, really nice. I didn't touch the tip of this one, so I'm gonna put this one back in the bag and put this in my giveaway, but I'm definitely gonna keep these and I'm super excited for these. The next item we have, <laughs> This is one of my absolute favorite cleansers. I actually have quite a few. Um, it's never bad to have a backup because I use them daily. So uh, this is the uh, Kors Forming, Foaming Cream Cleanser. <sighs> I love their cleanser so, so much. It gets all the dirt and makeup off. It doesn't leave me feeling like my skin has been dried like a desert. So. So excited that this is in here. This is definitely a plus. The next item we have is item. <laughs> uh, this is the One Hit Prime Set and Refresh Dewy Finish Face Mist. Um, so this has got to be a new brand because I've never heard of it. 
So it says, in with the good, infused with aloe vera and tiger grass extracts to help calm and soothe, lavender and rose waters to help tone and brighten, and sodium uh, hyaluronate, hyaluronate uh, to hold in moisture. This is vegan and cruelty free. So let's give this a shot and see what this is like. On the inside of the box, it says a dose of self-love. That's really nice. I like that everything is like positive and uplifting. That's just, I don't know, it just makes me smile, you know? It's a feel good, feel good message. So this is what, I guess I could put the topic on. So this is what the bottle actually looks like itself. Kind of cool, it has a good weight to it. So. The spray, um, it's definitely, ooh, a very strong mist. So I'm gonna have to hold this pretty far away. Mmm, that smells good though. Mmm, that smells good. I like that. Uh, typically, I don't like like rose water scents, but mixed with lavender, it smells really nice. Mmm. Yeah, I like that. Okay. Moving on. So the next item we have is from Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is their Liquid Glow Highlighter. Very nice. I have not tried their liquid highlighters, um, so this is exciting. This is in the shade. Perla. So this is what it looks like right here. And let's see. Ooh, a little bit's gonna go a long way with this. Wow. That's pretty. Now that is just in my uh, ring lights. Imagine how that would look in the sun. Very nice. Okay, so we're happy with that. And then our last item <laughs> is from Ofra. So we are seeing some awesome brands. I got Coors, I got ABH, and I got Ofra in one bag. That is so cool. So this is the uh, blush, overall blush, liquid to bake and smoothing blush in the shade Bellini. I don't think I've tried an Ofra brush, brush, blush. <laughs> um, I've tried their highlighters. They are one of my top favorite highlighters of all time. So this is actually really exciting. All right, so this is in their packaging, same as the highlighter and <gasps> What a pretty shade. Oh my goodness. Oh, that is so pretty. It's like a, a peachy kind of pink color. Look how stunning that is. That is gonna be so freaking perfect for the summertime. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh yeah, so it's like a sun kissed, like on your cheek kind of. Ugh. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. It's so pretty. Okay, so really quickly, let's just go back over the back. So we got the Coors Face Foaming Cleanser. Love this stuff, full size bottle. This is gonna go straight in my bathroom. This is my number one cleanser, so happy to have this. We have the ABH highlighter, which is stunning, such a beautiful shade. I've never had an ABH highlighter like this before, so this is a plus for me. We have the Ofa blush, which is a stunning color, perfect for like spring and summer. Really excited to have this. Ah, I love Ofa so much, they're such an awesome brand. Uh, we have the brush set, which I love brushes and then the setting spray which smelled so nice so I would say you guys this is like one of the best bags I've gotten so far this year um, I'm really happy like I'm really genuinely very happy with this bag oh Ipsy really needs to keep this up because this bag is like set in the bar man it's set in the bar so next month I either has to be on the same level or better so, good job, Ipsy. All right, guys, so that's it for this unbagging. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a big ol' thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell. That way you can be notified when my videos go live, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.